The ousted president is wanted for mass murder and on the run in the south, probably Crimea, seen leaving a private house there. And Ukraine is still on the streets, watching a new government form, mourning the dead and enjoying a strange period when the people are the only real power around. Moscow's been pretty silent so far about losing its main ally here, the ex-president, and the United States hopes it stays out militarily. That would be a grave mistake. Ukrainians still digesting the rapid collapse of their past and the immense wealth of Yanukovych here at his personal retreat. A day out to see what money can buy if you really don't have anything sensible to do with it. Soon, it may be Yanukovych, their former owner, who's behind the bars. He didn't even drive these. A 50s Bentley, whatever this is, and an American army jeep. In the end, he fled, of course, in the presidential helicopter. And not in this, a massive riverboat for partying. Outside, fascination at the life he led and they could only look in on while their country stagnated. Inside, gifts from guests. Well, in the months ahead, when Ukraine comes to terms with the troubled economy and asks, where did all the money go? Here is part of the answer. The president's own vodka. Even the presidential waste gets guilt. <laughs> we later got inside his house. A bizarre, enormous, empty mansion. It was gaudy, but vacant. Everything laid on, even a tunnel linking the houses across miles and miles of grounds. The luxury literally never seemed to end. In his bedroom, one bell for sex, one for alcohol. It was presumably a joke, but how he lived to the people whose money this was isn't. Such a bizarre atmosphere inside that empty house. Money really accrued, but seemingly for no reason. No one there, it seemed, to actually have enjoyed it while Yanukovych was there. But those missing billions, I think, people will now increasingly focus upon. Ukraine's just said it needs $35 billion, some of it, it hopes, from America to see itself out of the economic crisis that's coming to them right now.